Welcome to Outbreak Reviews. This is Kazuhira with my first Metal Gear review. I will be reviewing In Flames and Head Play's 1 6 scale figure of Big Boss from Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker. For those of you who have not heard of Big Boss, he is one of the lead characters from Hideo Kojima's Metal Gear Solid series. The origin of the character was explored in Metal Gear Solid 3 Snake Eater on the PlayStation 2 and later fleshed out in Metal Gear Solid Portable Ops and the most recent Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker for the Sony PSP consoles. In Flames and Headplay have modelled their figure after the Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker version of Big Boss. Since the figure was not officially licensed, there is no mention of Big Boss or Metal Gear Solid on the box. The figure was instead called Metal Boss for obvious reasons. The figure is presented nicely in a silver slipcase box with nice artwork on the front and on the back. Removing the slipcase reveals a box that folds out into two sections. Enclosed in one section is an assortment of accessories and in the other is the figure itself and more accessories. Metal Boss includes the following. A black jumpsuit. The olive drab battle dress uniform. Jungle boots. An alternative Skull Camo Uniform Tactical Shoulders Tactical Sleeves Tactical Knee Pads Suspenders Ammo Pouches Canteens The Combat Field Pack An Equipment Belt an eye patch, a headband, a crocodile cap, a 1 6 scale carton box, the M16 assault rifle, the MK23 with removable clip. Silencer and a laser aiming module. A carbon knife and carbon holster. and a tactical knife with scabbard. The accessories are very difficult to put on and there are no instructions. I should point out that the figure does not come with anything to attach the eye patch, the carbon knife, nor his tactical knife. The figure has all your usual. 12 inch figure scale articulation, including head, shoulder, elbow, wrist, hip, 
नहीं एंड एंकू आर्टिकुलेशन द थिक क्लोथिंग डजेंट अलाउ मच मूवमेंट देर फोर इट रिस्ट्रिक्स आर्टिकुलेशन आई फैंड इट डिफिकल्ट टू गेट दिस फिगर पोज बिकॉज द आर्म्स के ट्राइन टू मूव बैक टू इट्स ओरिजिनल पोजिशन What the figure lacks in functionality, it makes up for in quality. The sculpt is amazing. The face is very realistic. The headband looks like it was pulled directly out of the game. It's got wiring through it, so you can get the look of it being caught in the wind. It's even got the scrunches above the eyebrows. The clothing is second to none. Everything from the stitching to the materials used is of high quality it literally is a miniaturized version of the real thing even the boots have proper laces the quality of the weapons are just as good stick around for final thoughts after the break Final thoughts. For a custom figure, I think in flames and head play have done a great job in portraying Big Boss from Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker. It's got a high quality head sculpt and equally high quality accessories. The only problems I had with the figure was the restrictive articulation, no instructions for the accessories and Some of the accessories had no means of securing them on the figure. I rate this figure 7.9 out of 10. It doesn't get higher because of the many drawbacks and the fact that it's not a licensed product. Nevertheless, at the time of its release, it was the best 1/6 scale figure of Big Boss on the market. If you're a fan of the Metal Gear series, and busting to get a 1/6 scale figure look no further however if you don't mind waiting hot toys will be releasing two 1/6 scale figures by the end of this year one of naked snake or big boss and the other of the boss both featured in metal gear solid 3 snake eater this is kazuhira and i'll see you soon youtube Start talking. I am not hiding anything from you. 